Hey everybody, we're the Nerds. I'm Jeremy. I'm Stephanie. We're here today at Black Rifle Coffee Company in Sevierville, Tennessee. This is our newest location. We're going to head inside. I know the coffee's already good here. Never tried some treats. So we're going to try some food, some coffee. And if you're ready, Steph, let's head inside. Let's Just a black rifle coffee, but just the small details are awesome. This is the trench knife or knuckle knife right there. That's just a cool small touch just to make it even a cooler coffee shop. So cool addition right there. So this is the inside of black rifle coffee. They have a gift shop here. Order all your food up there. There's the menu. This is the drop zone where you pick up your coffee at right there or your food. Turning around this way, this is where all the tables are. You have all your coffee or uh, creamers and sugars and everything you need right over here. Here's a look at the menu here. Lots of good sounding hot drinks. They got the cold drinks there. The mocha cold brew sounds really good. The food all sounds good. Lemon loaf, sausage balls. It's a pretty good sounding menu up here. Hey, we got the coffee really good here as well. Hey, how you doing? Good, doing good, thank you, ma'am. Um, can I get a small white mocha? Hot rice. Hot, please. And would you like whipped cream? Um, no, thank you. And order a sausage ball? You got it. Uh, I'll do the uh, mocha cold brew uh, 16 ounce. And then. What else did you want to get, babe? I don't want anything else. Um, do you get the lemon thing? Yeah, let's do a lemon bundt cake. Yeah, would you like the one down? Sure. Uh, sure, that'd be good. Anything else for y'all? No, that's it. Could I get a name for the order? Stephanie. Stephanie, please buy it for me. S-T-E-P-H-A-N-I-E. Are you guys military veterans? No. No, ma'am. Okay, it'll be eight. Thank you. Here's a look around the gift shop right here. Black Rifle Company, or Coffee Company t-shirts. They got the ready to drink uh, drinks right there. They have pouches right there, shirts. Some really nice hats over here. They got some uh, tumblers down there. More of their K-Cup boxes. They have more shirts over here. They got jackets. They have all kinds of drinks over here. This is all their uh, ready-made drinks in the can. Got some ready-made food there. Liquid death water. Sodas. Stubborn uh, sodas. And here's some more of the merchandise here. Those hats are really nice right there. They got mugs down here as well. A really nice gift shop in here. There's got all their boxes of K-Cups up here. They have all the coffees down here as well. And then turning around this way, this is all their coffees they have here in the store. More coffees in the store here. And more coffees right now. But right now, this uh, Lava Panther, I think is their special right now they have. And we showed this before where the creamer and stuff is. They got ice water up here for you. It's the back of a Hummer, which is really cool. Then over here, they got dog treats for free. Water bowl for your dog down there. Even the trash can that's cool over here. Really cool setup. Just a view from our table right now. You see all the other tables out here in the gift shop and the little lounge area right there. But I just love the space. A lot of times coffee shops are crowded. There's tons of space, tons of seating here. It's just really, really comfortable here. Really nice coffee shop. All right, so our food is here. We got the lemon loaf warmed. The sausage balls there. Steph got the white hot mocha. And I've got the uh, cold mocha uh, cold brew. So we got the lemon loaf warmed. Excellent. The sausage balls taste like homemade. And that's what I did. Mocha, cream, or mocha cold brew. Fantastic. All right, Steph, what do you think so far? Yeah, the sausage balls are really good. Like you said, they do taste like they're homemade. I really like those. And this lemon loaf thing was delicious. How's your coffee? Um, it's okay. I like mine a little sweeter, but it's good. One more look at our black rifle skeleton there. Happy Valentine's Day. And on the table, so they got chess here as well. And just, this is just a really nice coffee shop in here. Like, it's just nice. This is the back of the building here, the drive through. And look, it's got the uh, military fly with the army guy there, or military guy, and the coffee or die with the snake. So, cool little thing back here. Get a photo in front of it if you want to. And 
they do a drive through which is awesome. So, really cool coffee shop here. We are back in the car now, so it has some good coffee for me. Uh, Steph didn't like her coffee as much, unfortunately, but I would say the uh, Mocha Cold Brew, really good, less acidity. I love cold brew coffee, so that's great. You can get like that. A lot of places just have normal coffee as a mocha. Mm -hmm. Sausage balls, amazingly fun, really good. Like, it tastes like homemade. Lemon loaf, I liked it quite a bit. Get it again. A little too sweet for me, but I don't like sweet things as much as far as like my cakes. Uh, like more like dark chocolate and things like that. That are not, like, I don't have just like that burst of sweetness. Um, tons of room inside the coffee shop. Sometimes we go to coffee shops, and I go to a lot of coffee shops myself, and you're kind of crammed in there. Very quaint, very small. Tons of room in there. Now I already like Black Rifle Coffee. I had their K cups several times, and I like Black Rifle Coffee. So this is just a great coffee shop. I'm glad they have it open here. The decor is cool. Dog biscuits, dog water, the trench knife or knuckle knife on the door, the Hummer for the creamer area and the sugar area, the drop zone where you get your coffee. Like, A plus on theming. Super great staff. Um, yeah, I just highly recommend a great coffee shop. Uh, for me. So you don't like your coffee, but I think you like everything else, right? I'm not a huge coffee person, so I'm not going to jump in on this one because I don't know much about coffee or what it should taste like or shouldn't taste like. I just know that when I do drink coffee, <laughs> I need it to be sweetened, and yeah. that one is, wasn't very sweet, so it was fine. The food was good. Yeah, I did try Stephanie's uh, white mocha. I actually liked it better than Starbucks because Starbucks is very sweet, but when you order a milk a lot of times, you're looking for the sweetness. So I think that's the difference. Like for me, I don't like the sweetness as much. That's why I usually go with cold brews or things that are not like a sweet drink. So I liked it, but if you like a really sweet, like Stephanie said, you wouldn't like the white milk probably. Now my cold brew does have a little bit of sweetness in there with the mocha. Um, but it's not super strong either, but I like it personally. So yeah, it's, I guess it's more of a personal difference of like. Yeah. Uh, so to keep the heads up, if you do like an extra sweet, maybe ask for an extra couple pumps of the syrup if you come here. Uh, or to just take it a sip first. If you say, hey, I need a little more in there, ask them for it. They'll, they said staff was friendly, so they were really nice. So, uh, yeah. Get them sausage bowls, y'all. Them things are good. Here we go. Every coffee shop, this video probably won't be seen by every coffee shop, but every coffee shop, if you ever watch this video, put sausage balls on your menu. Like that's such a basic item that everybody can make at home. That's so good. And it goes perfect with coffee. Sausage balls <laughs> at coffee shops. The nerds are out. Oh, wait. <laughs> the nerds are out. <laughs>